All new this morning, Christmas Eve and Christmas Day are right around the corner, and by this time you may have already made your plans to attend church. Well, First News reporter Brooke Meenahan is live in the newsroom this morning with what you can expect if you're attending Mass this holiday season. Good morning, Brooke. Hey, good morning, Brandon. Well, hopefully by this time, people have already made those plans to attend Christmas Eve or Christmas Day Mass if they're going to this holiday season. Because if you normally attend Christmas Eve Mass at, let's say, 4 uh, p.m., there's a good chance that you might not be able to this year. Now, Christmas Eve and Christmas Day Masses, uh, local churches are adjusting that the way they are held this holiday season. Normally, we're used to seeing those big crowds gather on both days, but this year, parishes have limited the amount of people allowed in at each mass. Some have been taking reservations, others have added more times, and for some it's first come first serve. I spoke with Monsignor John Zero with the Diocese of Youngstown and he tells me this is unknown territory for both the parishes and the parishioners. He wants to remind people that just because you might not be at mass this Christmas, Christmas that there are still ways to worship on your own. No one is forced. Uh, you know, use your best judgment. If you are not feeling well, stay home. If you are apprehensive, stay home. Um, this is an opportunity for us to keep everyone safe. Now, churches across the area are doing their best to accommodate everyone, giving everything going on this year. As I mentioned, some places have added more mass times to accommodate more people. Some have extended the Christmas celebration into the weekend. For the people who might not be able to attend in person or aren't comfortable going, there's other ways to celebrate from the comfort of your own home. Now, some parishes have added virtual mass where you can watch online, and there will also be live broadcasts available throughout the week and throughout the weekend to be able to enjoy and celebrate and worship from the comfort of your own home. So no matter what your situation, there are options to celebrate and worship. Uh, again, no matter what your uh, circumstances are this year because of COVID-19. For now, reporting live in the newsroom, Brooke Meanahan at First News this morning.